Now we're going to move on to taking multiple steps forward. Dot, 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 five, six, seven, eight, one, two. Here's how rolling your feet looks. Notice as her front foot, when the toe goes down, her heel of the back foot is coming up and slides forward. You want to make sure that your toe stays up on the step and then goes down at the same time as your heel coming up from your other foot. Now we're going to move on to taking four steps. Dut, 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 dut. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Okay. Remember to glide your heel across the, across the grass or asphalt or whatever surface you're on. Always have your toes pointed up. We always have our toes pointed Here's up. Here's a full body shot of taking four steps. Dut, 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 dut. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Notice that my weight is in the middle of my two feet, right in the middle of my body. My toe is up and my heel is up. Focus there. Here's how to take four steps nice and slow. Dut, 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 dut. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Now we're going to practice taking eight steps. Eight steps is a very common interval in marching band, and we also use eight steps to span five yards. Here we go. Dut, 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 dut. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, when you march, you need to keep your feet in straight lines. We often refer to these as ski lines because it's as if you were wearing a pair of skis and you were going down a mountain. They're going to be straight. You're always going to have them the same. So when I do my ski lines and I move my feet, my feet are always in straight lines. They're not going to either side. They're not doing any of that stuff. They're just straight lines. And they're, perp they're, not, they're not perpendicular to each other. They're parallel to each other. You also don't want this, this action. Nope, not at all. Straight, straight, straight. Go. An important concept to grasp when learning forward marching is that your feet cross one another on the ands. So, watch. You're gonna take step one, and then on and of one, so you're gonna go one, and it's gonna cross. One, cross, two. So watch again. One, cross, two. I'll do it with my right foot first. Sorry. I'll do it with my, yeah, with my right foot first so you can see it a little clearer. One, cross, two. One, cross, two. Alright, now I'm going to do eight steps forward with an instrument. Now I don't play the trumpet, so my technique may not be perfect, but I wanted to show you on a common instrument how it will look to do your eight steps. You start in your set position, and then I will have Sean dut me off and go eight steps. Dut, 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 five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's how it's gonna look. Make sure you have your trumpet any instrument, any brass instrument really, 10 degrees above parallel at all time. Do not move your instrument up and down. Do not move your body up and down. And that will give you the clearest, crispest sound that you can get while looking as good as possible.